We are purpose driven in the city of New Orleans because this is our time and we have the power to change the lives within our community, to change the lives of our people. Mayor Cantrell and Chief Ferguson presided over the greatest reduction in violent crime and the lowest murder rate in the history of the city. You may want to give us credit for doing this, but it only really matters and is sustainable if y'all do it with us. And I'm not big on telling you what we're going to do. I really want to demonstrate that we can do it. We're here today celebrating the Cure Violence Program. It collectively brought together the barbers and beauticians in the community to do something about the violence in our community. We took them through a rigorous seven-week process in terms of every Monday uh, they would meet to uh, be presented with different methods to de-escalate uh, violence in our community, in our city. And through those methods, really, uh, one, letting them understand that they really do have that power to turn situations around that prevent violence on our streets. They pretty much taught the skill sets of what type of things to say not to be biased, what type of things to do to help a person cope. You basically give them alternatives and options, and hopefully they'll use them alternative options and give them to other people too when they're going to deal with the same situation. Now, neighborhoods are literally armed with centers within their community where de-escalation is happening. This is phenomenal. To you, fellas, thank you for your dedication, for your commitment to our city. It takes a village. We cannot, we as a police department, cannot do it alone. And we want barbers and beauticians throughout this city to recognize the power that they have as influencers. That's how I would encourage them to get involved because while they're powerful on their own, it's the strength and power of community that would write the course in violence in the city of New Orleans. I feel good about it. I feel like it's, you know, it's a passion, like it's really coming from the heart. But this just gave me a, a better understanding, a better skill set to use while I'm trying to help. And I believe in this program or I wouldn't have been in it. And just give us a little time. We're going to show you up. We're going to be all right. If we're going to get off the roller coaster called violence, all of us need to be on the roller coaster called peace. And so we can't be on where we are, but it takes us to be unbreakable. And life's harder to comprehend when there's not a man there to teach you. That's why it's our obligation as a community to reach you. Listen, true soldiers die for a cause, not just because. Stop the violence rights. Amen.